hello guys this is shiva here again welcome back to my channel um in today's video i'll be sharing with you guys a volatility strategy all right this is a strategy you can use on all volatility indices all right so um, without wasting much of our time let me quickly share with you guys the settings for this strategy and then i will explain how the strategy works all right so you are going to first of all click on this icon here so after that the next thing you have to do you have to click on this icon and then you search for the macd right so now for the macd here are the parameters the first ema is 12 the slow ema is 26 the macd sma is 9 the apply to is close under the style we have the mean which is one pixel the color is white and the signal which is three pixel the color is red right so after that you click on save that's all you need for the macd the next indicator here is the bollinger band right now when when you finish adding up your macd the indicator window one will be formed and this icon here will appear okay so before you add the bollinger band you have to click on that second icon and then you search for the Bollinger Band. Now, here are the parameters for the Bollinger Band. The period is 200. Deviation is 1.500. The shift is zero. They apply to, you have to apply to first indicators that are the, under the style, we have three pixel and the color here is blue, right? But you can use any color of your choice. So after that, you click on save. Now the next indicator here is the moving average. And you have to click on this second icon in order to add the moving average now the parameters for the moving average the period here is 12 the shift is zero the method is exponential the apply to is first indicators data this time we have three pixel the color is green all right now you click on save all right and that is all for the um indicator setting you go back you are going to have a screen like this whenever you have done everything correctly okay now let me show you guys how the strategy work all right this is a very simple strategy to understand now you see this blue blue lines here these are the bollinger band lines all right and this red line is the stochastic the macd line the macd signal line and the green line here is the moving average all right so now this is how the strategy work so whenever you observe on the indicator window that these two red the, the two line here the red and the green gets below the bollinger band all right whenever it breaks out of the bollinger band the third bollinger band line this one or this one all right so in this case it happened below here which is to show that price has gone to the oversold level all right now, whenever you see that it breaks out like this, the next thing you have to observe is to wait for a crossing to, to occur, okay? Now, you see that the green line here cross above the red one, all right? That is a signal for buy, all right? So, whenever you observe that crossing, all right, you don't just go in for buy it, okay? Let me show you a simple price action technique you use along with this strategy in order to be profitable. Now, let's zoom in so that I'll show you. Now, when price was coming down, you can see it was making this lower lows and lower highs here. All right. So you can see that. So now, price made this structure here. It breaks, and here it make another structure. All right. So now, before you take an entry with this kind of strategy, all right. You must make sure price breaks the most recent structure of the market all right so now this is the structure price is supposed to break before we confirm that the trend has changed this one right here this is the most recent structure all right so whenever you observe this crossing here on the indicator window you are not to take any entry until is either you use your horizontal line here to mark out this uh, area right mark out this zone and then what you have to do is to wait for price to break above that structure right wait for 
price to break and close above that structure before you take your entry all right now this is what happened here price came down made another uh, structure here but it fails to uh, make another lower low all right so now it reverses all right and this is the area here that you are going to check that price has you are going to use this area here to confirm that price has fully reversed and the trend of the market is now changing all right so you can see this candle here breaks above and close at this area here okay and now it came back to retest all right so there are two ways you can take this entry it's either you wait for immediately this candle close and you go in and your stop loss is going to be below this structure here or you can wait for the retest to come all right so when the retest come and you see that price has closed above this zone again this uh, area here just like in this green candle here you can take your entry and then the stop loss is going to be below this area here whichever way works for you you can just go with it all right so these are the two ways you can take entry with this strategy all right now you can even decide to take your entry from this area too all right so you see price kind of went up here and there was a bounce back and then here also rejects it and now you see this is a double uh, this is a double bottom here right you can see this is a double bottom here so you can decide to take your trade from this area too all right all right so whenever the price breaks above this area you can decide to take your entry from the close of that candle and place your stop loss below this area all right so there are a lot of way you can use price action in order to take entry with this strategy all right so what you need to wait for is to wait for the indicator to give you the signal and then you can apply a little bit of price action to take your entry all right so now to make things simple for you guys once you see the crossing once you see that the green is crossing the red and you wait for the most recent structure the market made all right you 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 mark out the most recent structure or you can be marking it as price is going you can mark this area here you mark it mark the area whenever it forms any structure you mark that area you can just mark another one here again too and then you wait for price to break above it all right so you mark this one so whenever price breaks and close above it you can take your entry from this area this can the close of this candle and the stop loss is going to be below that structure there the most recent structure the market make so in this case now you'll be risking like 3.71 dollars all right so this is how to go about it and for your tp you are to either target the most recent structure like in this case this one here sorry let me delete this all right so this is here we place our tp stop loss below this yeah and you can place the tp to be to, to target the most recent structure the market made something of this nature and that is how you to you are to go about with this kind of thing so as you, as you can see that tp was hit all right that tp was hit so this is how you are to go about this all right so now now like in this case you see price has gotten to this area here and you have to wait for this structure here to be broken below before you take any sell trade all right and if it fails to break it you can just leave that and wait for when it breaks that structure and that is how you, you have to go so currently we are kind of in an uptrend on this market so you can see that if you analyze from the higher time frame you see that we are in an uptrend all right so now you can see in this case here on the indicator window it doesn't broken above the bollinger band so i don't think there's any need for you to take any entry because it will still go up all right you can see it's still going up now in this case it broke above and now you can start 
looking for the break of structure in order to apply the strategy but as you all know the strategy is 100 percent and we are kind of in an uptrend in this market right now so it's better you look for buy trades only okay make sure you you also observe or you do an, your analysis from the higher time frame and you draw your trend line to make sure you are in line with the trend of the market all right so currently we are in an uptrend and we are supposed to be looking for buy trades only on the five minute time frame all right so whenever you analyze you go to the five minute time frame or the 15 minute time frame all right any time frame you wish to apply the strategy it works okay so make sure you back test the strategy and see if it's working for you before you can go in with your live account okay make sure you back test all right so for me i like to use the five minute time frame because i just want to go in and get out okay i'm a scalper so i don't want to hold trade for long so i normally like using the five minute time frame so in this kind of case you see price came to the trend line here and you can see it has broken through the Bollinger band you wait for that crossing and you wait for the break of structure here you take your entry from here stop loss below and then you you target for the most recent structure the market make it has it's as simple as that guys okay so make sure you backtest the strategy see how good it is for yourself if it's working for you fine if it's not working then you can search for another strategy i have a lot of strategy here on my channel you can just go and search for anyone that works for you best and then you can apply that and start making money okay so i think that's pretty much everything i have for you guys in today's video thanks for watching and for those of you who are just coming across my channel for the first time please make sure you do subscribe all right turn on your notification bell so that whenever i post a powerful strategy like this you get notified immediately okay and please guys don't forget to share this video with your friends so that they also may get this strategy and use it to make money okay so um, i think i'll be closing the curtain now guys i'll be seeing you guys in the next video thanks for watching silver out